Is Melissa Garcia available? I can check my phone. Eric Shelley. And what's the call regarding? Uh, well, I called last, well, hmm, when was it, Friday, and uh, asked if she had received uh, an email uh, requesting a town hall to congressman. Uh, and after five days, she hadn't finished uh, composing that letter. I uh, said she needed a couple more days. It's uh, now 11 o'clock on Monday, and I still haven't received a response. I'm wondering if uh, she's going to respond to that request. Just a moment. Thank you. Sir? Yes. Yeah, uh, Melissa stepped out, but I was wondering if there's a time where you can be reached. I have a cell phone with me. You can call me at any time. Okay, what is the number? 248. 982-6326. Okay, thank you. Do you know where she went? Hello? Hello? Yes, uh, this is Eric Shelley. I believe I was cut off. Oh, okay. Do you know who you were speaking to? Uh, I was trying to talk to uh, Miss Garcia, but I was told she was out of town. Or she left the office. You tried to talk to I'm sorry. I, can't, I couldn't hear you. Uh, Melissa Garcia. Oh, okay. Um, and what was this in regards to? Uh, a letter that I sent, but she's she's not in the office, so... Yeah, she's not at her desk right now. Um, uh... I can tell that you called. Does she have your contact information, sir? Well, I left my contact information with another person and then he hung up, so I, I just wanted to uh, leave, leave a message for her. Okay, sure, go ahead. Okay, here's the message. Uh, I've, I've begun a fast until I meet with my congressman. Do you understand? Yes, sir. Okay, I'm not going to eat until I meet with him. Okay, I understand, sir. So it's very important that I meet with them so that I can eat again. I understand. Okay, if you pass that along to Ms. Garcia, I would appreciate it. I certainly will, sir. Have a great day. Thank you. Bye. And now we wait. So I waited for about an hour, and then I said, screw this, and went down the street to see a congressman meet with his constituents. This is what a thriving democracy looks like. On Thursday, Representative John Dingell got roughed up on health care. But on Monday, he was back to talk about bank bailouts, reinvestment, and Glass-Steagall. He took a stand, he took his lumps, and he made his point. No. That's, that's, that's the answer to your question. And, and I'm not sure that all of you... Now, McCotter, on the other hand. Representative McCotter's office, how can I help you? Is Melissa Garcia available? Uh, may I ask who's calling? Eric Shelley. Okay, uh, can I ask what you're calling regarding, sir? Uh, well, I uh, was waiting for a request, uh, a response to a request for a town hall meeting. Uh, I was told I would have one today, and there's only about 45 minutes left in today. Okay. okay, sure. Hold on one moment. Thank you. Hi, Eric. Yes. Um, she's actually not available to come to the phone right now, but I haven't heard of any town hall meetings for today. Did you get a call about that? or? No, there aren't any, and that's the problem. Oh, okay. Can I help you with something else then, or? Well, uh, she said she would respond to my letter. Okay. I've been waiting for a week to an answer what seems like a pretty reasonable question. Mm -hmm. Which is simply, how do does one set up a town hall? Okay, sure. Well, I can definitely pass that message on along to her uh, for you. Did, has she left yet? Um, I'm not sure where she is. I think she had had a meeting. Well, I... 
You think she's at a meeting? If she's at a meeting, then she'll be coming back to her desk? I'm, I'm not sure of her schedule, sir. I don't know when the meeting will be over All or right, when so she'll be back. Tell you what, then. I'll hold. You want to go on hold? Yes. Okay, hold on one second. Thank you. <laughs>